Oh my. When will I learn not to trust Stibbins? He's ruined everything. Oh, such a relief to see a familiar face in this ghastly desert. Particularly today. You helped me get the crown of Anton. Would you consider assisting in my archaeological efforts again? I've encountered something of a setback here. Well, I discovered this fabulous portal in the Aeliot ruins. I sent my assistant through, and... It was a mistake. The portal apparently leads to somewhere in the Grotwood, and... Basically, he returned with the Ald Mary army at his heels. Yes, and unfortunately, it seems they're now planning a full-scale invasion. Establishing a base, building siege weapons... We need to close the portal, quickly. I discovered an old tome that explains how, if I can find it again. Will you help me? You're a true hero, and I mean that. My camp is beside the ruins. That's where I left the book we need. Get the book, use it to activate the large pillars in the ruins. Then meet me inside the west door to the lower ruins. The portal's down there. I suppose that's a reasonable question. As you might imagine, the elves have locked the main entrance to the portal room. There is a back way, however, through an old prison of some sort. The pillars unlock the door into the prison. Oh, I haven't the foggiest notion what's in the prison. It's been centuries, though. Whatever was down there is surely dead. If not, well, you seem capable enough. And it can't be any worse than the damned elves. My researchers in High Rock gave me the essential background. Solace N was an alien stronghold, built by human slaves in the Marithic era. The elves eventually got what they deserved during the Yokudan colonization of Hammerfell in the First Era. It's quite fascinating, really. It would seem to prove that the Altmer and the Aeliots were still connected further into the Marithic era than we believed. I actually wrote a book on the subject. Well, someone wrote it for me, but who's counting? Oh, how kind of you to ask. Let's see. I was in Rothgar for a while, but Orcish history is such a bore, so I left there and visited some Dwemer ruins in Morrowind. Then I wound up coming here. Stibbins has remained with me, of course. Regrettably. Who knows? Who cares? The blathering fool created such a mess here. He's become a liability, especially since the Tomb of Kings. I have a new man assisting me now. He's much more... efficient. Not as efficient as you, but you're not for hire. Oh, uh, hello. I was just tidying up. This was our camp before the elves came. Well, it was Lady Laurent's camp. Oh, I shouldn't say our anymore. Oh, goodness, what will I do? She fired me! Because it's all my fault. The Ald Mary. Lady Laurent sent me through the portal to investigate. When the elves saw me, I ran and led them to the portal. So now she hates me. Please, I beg you, will you help me get back in her good graces? Praise you. Praise you. I'm trying to gather all her things. But her tools are scattered out in the ruins. And those are her most important possessions. If you'll get the tools for me, I just know she'll forgive me. I just know it. There's one more thing you should know. Lady Laurent hired this thuggish Tamian fellow. And I believe she already asked him to recover her tools. You should speak to him up on the ramparts. And tell him we have it taken care of. Because he's a brute, and I need to be the one to give her the tools. If I can't make her forgive me, she'll just leave me here, and then what will I do? This is my only chance. Well, you and I both know I'm not really Stibbins, but I think I'm doing a good job of playing the part. 
This Tamian fellow is just complicating things. I'll never forget what you did for me back at the tomb, by the way. Well, if it isn't my old friend from Crosswitch. Let me guess, Lady Laurent has you helping clean up this mess she made. Or is it Stibbins, the bootless coward? He's hoping Lady Laurent will forgive him. It could be worse. Lady Laurent pays well, and she's got a pretty ambitious travel schedule. So I'm getting to see places I had never dreamed of. Can't say this desert's one of the highlights, though. Did he? I'm surprised he could get that out through the whimpering and whining. Lady Laurent already has someone to recover her tools. And you would recover them and give Stibbins the credit? Just following orders. Even before this, Stibbins couldn't keep up, so Lady Laurent hired me. I was just getting a bird's eye view before getting to work. Say, though, if you were going to save Stibbins the trouble, why not help me instead? Well, for one thing, I'm better looking. For another, I'm actually getting paid. Stibbins was always just a glorified slave. Help me get the tools and I'll cut you in. Don't think too long. I'll go down there and get the tools myself if I have to. They're in backpacks, by the way. I bet Stibbins didn't even tell you that. I was wondering if you were going to ask that. Yeah, I snatched up a few tool bags earlier. But there's no reason for me to give them to you, is there? I suppose if you want to lug around the extra weight, I won't complain. Once you've got them all, though, just remember to bring them back to me, not Stibbins. Don't think too long. I'll go down there and get the tools myself if I have to. They're in backpacks, by the way. I bet Stibbins didn't even tell you that.
Well, I think I've gathered up all of Lady Daron's personal effects from the camp. I just need those tools from out in the ruins. I don't suppose you beat Tamian to them, did you? Praise the Eight. You just saved my reputation and my livelihood. Can I have the tools, then? Ha! That sneaky Tabian fellow sure will be surprised. Hopefully now Lady Laurent will forgive me and realize we don't need any hired help. A mercenary. What an oblivion was she thinking? You certainly made short work of those elves. There seem to be few odd skeletons down here. No problem for you, I'm sure. Now, I assume you found the old tome in my camp? Thank you very much. Fortunately, I can translate the ancient Iliad, and that should tell us how to close the portal. It's through this door right behind me. The problem is that it's locked, but it appears that it's controlled by a switch deeper in the ruins. Would you be a dear and find the switch? <sighs> Only I could have someone like you around full time. If you'll get the switch, that will give me time to study up whatever words I need to speak to close the portal. Once you get it opened, I'll just go on in, so meet me in the portal room. Before you speak, stranger, know this. For centuries a spell has bound me. Many have tried to free me and failed. This prison has no lock or bonds to break. Did you hear me? This is no common spell. It was cast by Ultimer wizards long since dead. This is a true curse. The task is beyond you. Of course, a fool would still try. Do as you wish. I won't harbor faint hope. For centuries, amateurs like yourself have tried to release me. Fools, all of you. You'd have a better chance of becoming the next Emperor. It pains me to speak of the past. Would you force me to relive such bitter memories? Ha! Please! There's a word I remember well. Please, she said to me. No one will know, she promised. She was wrong. Nuralanya, she was called in her high elven tongue. She was just Nura when we were together. I could deny her nothing. I was enthralled, a slave madly in love with his master. Our secret was eventually exposed, and the elves were furious. Our love was an abomination in their eyes. They decided execution was too kind a punishment for our crime. Aye, I was here, and she was there, to see one another, but not able to hear, or touch, or hold. Yet even that torment was insufficient for their retribution. The elves wove a spell to extend my life and prolong my torment. Elves live a long time, but not forever. I sat and watched as Nura slowly grew old and died. Sometime after that, the Regatta came and slaughtered the other elves. But even with them dead, the spell held strong. It was the Regatta, 
the warrior wave. The warriors sought vengeance. The swords of Yakuta passed through these halls, and the High Elves were washed away. They would have killed me, were it not for this spell. Instead, I watched, safely ensconced within this prison, as my captors were slaughtered. Many centuries passed before I learned who the warriors were, or from whence they came. A foreign people had arrived on these shores. They came from a distant land, Yakuta it was called. Yakutan warriors set out to conquer the new world they found. Singers named them the Regatta. If I knew, don't you think I would have escaped by now? All I know is the tiles must be used in the right order, and the order was determined by time, whatever that means. work. Under something.
By the bloody fangs of Moloch! By the stench of Moloch's gaping maw! What have you done? How can this be? I'm... free? I... I should thank you. But I don't even think this is what I wanted. It's been so long since my life was my own. This is all I know. I don't want to leave. The orc I know and love would never utter such words. Nura? Is it really you? It's been so long. We've suffered enough of this curse. By the grace of Mara, I have been allowed to take you beyond this mortal realm. Finally, a release from the suffering of this world. Come, my love. We have the rest of eternity to be together. They have so much faith in that seal they put on the main door. They don't even have anyone guarding the portal. I'm not complaining, though. Are you ready to do this? All right. You're going to have to protect me, though. The chamber may be clear now, but as soon as I start the ritual, they'll realize it on the other side. They might try to charge through and stop us. All right. Let's get this started. <clears throat> Groroso... Yeah. Woohoo! Take that, you damned elves! Oh, wait. I just lost my place. Alusaba. Takio? Takio. Takio? How do you pronounce this? All right, I think I've got it. Mala Alu Takeo. Well, that takes care of that now, doesn't it? I'm actually quite relieved. It would have been so embarrassing to have been responsible for the fall of Alakir. After I opened the portal, I considered just leaving and denying that I was ever here. I am too. Now. If you would, though, I still would prefer to keep this quiet. I do have a reputation to uphold, you know. <laughs> <laughs> 